breakfast groups devotional meetings. The photos you are viewing were taken at one of our recent meetings. Four of our members just returned from Guatemala, where they were a part of a special group who climbed a specific mountain in a quest to draw closer to God. This was a very specialized and organized trip with specific goals and objectives in mind. It was a difficult and demanding trip. The men shared so many of the experiences and how much the trip meant to them. This trip, with all its challenges, mirrors the challenges we face in our daily walk with Jesus. While they were there, they learned so many things about themselves and how to communicate one-on-one -on -one with God. Our walk with Him is a personal walk. While they were there, they were able to continue some of the work in Guatemala that had already been started. New ideas were formed also on how these men could help the people there and in other places. Imagine climbing a physical mountain, a challenging journey that signifies drawing nearer to God. Our members embrace this journey, facing physical and mental obstacles that reflect the hurdles of our faith journey. Now, we all will not be able to make a trip as these gentlemen did, but this should only give us the incentive to climb our own mountains here. Their journey should give us all an example to follow here on our quest to know Jesus on a personal level. As we navigate our lives, we encounter an array of challenges. These challenges aren't just inconveniences, they are opportunities for growth. Just as our members tackled obstacles on their journey, we confront trials that test and refine our faith. The challenges our members faced in Guatemala offer valuable lessons for our faith journey. Those moments of struggle and triumph illustrate how our challenges, when approached with faith, can bring us closer to God. Our response to Jesus' call is the sold-out program. Jesus beckons us to surrender our lives entirely to Him. He desires to walk beside us, guiding us through challenges and triumphs. To be sold out is to relinquish control and fully submit to Jesus. This act of surrender is rooted in trust, trusting that Jesus knows what's best for us in every circumstance. We invite you to embark on this journey of complete devotion to Christ. Sign up for our Thought for Today posts, offering daily inspiration. If you're in the Myrtle Beach area, join us at our Wednesday breakfast group. You can also connect with us on our website at www.soldoutsc.org. In conclusion, just as our members climb the mountain in Guatemala, we are all climbing the mountain of life with Christ. The challenges we face are opportunities to draw closer to Him. Let's embrace the sold-out life, giving our all to Jesus and placing unwavering trust in His plans for us. In a world filled with challenges, may we find solace in surrendering to Christ. Being sold out isn't just a phrase, it's a way of life, a daily choice to trust Jesus in everything.